What is up, everybody? I am Andre, and this is Edible Fitness, the fitness you can eat. So today is the taste test. We are looking at this right here. This is peak chocolate. What is peak chocolate? You're probably asking. Peak chocolate is the world's first high performance chocolate. What does that even mean? It is dark chocolate infused and enriched with supplements said to help you improve your life and to help you achieve your goals. Peak Chocolate was created by a couple of gym buddies, Rafe Friedman and Igor Sidelsky. The product comes from Australia and they were also seen on Shark Tank Australia. Did they get a deal? I don't think they got a deal. They didn't get a deal. No, they didn't get a deal. They didn't need it. On their website, they have three different types of chocolate bars. Now, when I say chocolate bars, they're, they're small. They come in three segments and they're individually wrapped in a box of three. And the first one that they have is Peak Rest. Peak Rest is their nighttime chocolate. You want me to eat chocolate at night? Uh, yeah. The next one is Peak Active. So Peak Active contains creatine, BCAAs, Himalayan salt, and natural caffeine. The third chocolate bar that they sell is Peak Focus. Now Peak Focus has lion's mane mushroom, green tea, ginkgo biloba, and natural caffeine. On top of that, they also have Peak Rest in powdered form. So you can have a nice cup of hot chocolate before you go to bed and relax. So the two that I tested out were um, Peak Focus and Peak Active. I don't have the box here, but uh, I did test those two out. So how did I test them out? You might be asking. With the Peak Active, I took it about a half hour before I trained. And uh, so I tested it out that way to see, did I notice any change? You know, was I, uh, did I have more energy? Was I more focused or whatever? Uh, so I did that on two occasions and I'll show you the workouts uh, and then we'll talk about that after. With the Peak Focus, I took it in the afternoon when I tend to feel a little, what's the word? You know, in the afternoon, you just feel a little slower than normal. Um, I'm usually really, really active and like ready and raring to go in the mornings. Come the afternoon time, like one, two o'clock, I'm just sort of like, uh, you know what I mean? But let's go through the workouts and then we'll talk about the two of them after. So let's talk. I like the taste of dark chocolate. I don't know about you guys, but let, you can let me know in the comments below how you feel um, about dark chocolate, but I like that bitter taste. These are, these are about 80%, I think 80% um, dark, yeah, 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 yeah. It's 80% uh, dark chocolate, so I like that taste. If you don't, you know, to each his own. You know, I felt like there was a bit more energy, a little bit more of a pump as I was going through uh, the exercises. 
That being said, it was nothing huge or over the top. It wasn't like, oh my gosh, now I have so much energy. <laughs> no, 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 nothing like that. It was really great. And it was really great also with the peak focus um, in that there was no crash, you know, at the end of the day. Um, I did have a bit more energy, uh, a bit more focus as well when I was going through the day, you know, um, two, three, four o'clock, you know, I wasn't as lethargic is like a strong word, but yeah, I wasn't as maybe slow as uh, I might normally have felt if, you know, maybe I wasn't eating properly that day or something like that, but uh, it was nice. It was nice. I, I enjoyed them. Yeah. Okay. So would I get them again? Yes. Would I recommend them? Yes. And on top of everything else, it's vegan friendly, it's gluten free and preservative free. Winning. All right. So now that I've tried it and talked about it to you guys, what about you? Have you tried it? All right, guys, that's it from me and Peak Chocolate. And uh, I will see you next time. So don't forget to hit that notification bell and leave a like and subscribe if you haven't already. Also, don't forget to hit that notification bell so you always know when I upload new and interesting videos just like this. All right, people, train hard, love your food, love your life, and I'll see you in the next video. Bye.